नमस्ते अ वेरी गुड आफ्टरनून एंड मोस्ट वेलकम टू यू ऑल द भ्यूअर्स एफ एम लिस्नर्स हेयर इन रेडियो मधेश में सलाह हंड्रेड सिक्स फोर मेगा हर्स वी आर गोइंग टू रन द रेडियो एजुकेशनल प्रोग्राम टू थाउजेंड सेवेंटी सेवेन विच इज ब्रॉडकास्टिंग बाई रेडियो एंड फेसबुक मीडिया फ्रॉम वन एंड ओनली डेडिकेटेड एफ एम रेडियो मधेश में सलाह हंड्रेड सिक्स एंड फोर मेगा हर्स My name is Bian Saudri, and uh, he is respected Santosh Thakur sir. Good afternoon. So today, the program radio educational program 2077, which is brought to you by uh, which is brought to you by Nepal Police School, and uh, this program is running in regular every Sunday to Friday. As per given routine by Nepal Police School. From today onward, the Nepal Police School Zingaria Gonra is running radio educational program to concern all the students of class two to five every Sunday to Friday as per the routine by schedule of Nepal Police School. So, without wasting of our time, we would like to begin our class. Respected Santosh Thakur sir, please carry on. We are here in live today. Thank you. Thank you, sir. <coughs> Welcome. So now, after morning classes, okay. Now we start. Uh, just we are going to teach. I am going to teach class four, okay. In class four today, just I selected a topic that is fraction. Fraction. As you uh, you have uh, listened or heard, uh, that that me I think. You have learned too, okay, about uh, fractions, okay. But <laughs> there is, uh, or in the fraction, there are different parts, okay. That uh, we should be learned about that, okay. So let's first we define the fraction first, okay. Uh, excuse me, sir. Uh, this is uh, the first chapter of class four. No, no, this is not first chapter. So uh, okay, so please carry on. Where fraction is a fraction is is an indication is an indication which express the Taken part from the whole number or things. Okay. Suppose uh, we have a bread. Okay. We yeah. have a bread. When we divide this bread into four equal parts. Okay. Suppose. We divide this bread into four equal parts. Then we will get okay four different parts like this. Okay. Yeah. In the same way. Okay, that means we have all together four parts. Okay, we got uh, four parts from one bread. Okay. Yeah, yeah, sure. These all are the whole number. That means the whole thing. Okay, where oh. in the same way the taken part means what? How much part? Will you, uh, or you you have taken or you have eaten? Okay. Suppose yeah. that uh, someone has taken these one parts. Yes. It means what? Taken part is what? One. Okay. Yeah, okay. And the whole parts are what? Four. Four. Yes. Yeah. So 
it forms a fraction suppose 1 by 4, four. okay in the same way if two part has been lost then yeah. its fraction becomes 2 by 4 okay that means just taken part should be written at the upper part yeah. upper side and the whole part should be written at the down part or the lower lower side okay yes in the same way it has just two things or A fraction has especially two parts, okay, that is numerator, okay, Num what is numerator, okay, it has two parts, for example, we can give some example here, 1 by 2, okay, 4 by uh, 5, suppose 6 by 5, etc, etc, okay, these all are the fraction. Fraction of example of the fraction. Yeah, example of the fraction. Yeah. Four numerator. Okay, suppose we have uh, one by two. Yeah. Yes. Which one is numerator? Okay. First, we have to calculate, uh, identify such things before uh, entering in inside the exercise. Okay. Yes. That's why. Uh, which one is the numerator? Okay. That means the upper number. Okay, which is showing, or uh, which is given uh, in the fraction, yes. the upper number is especially known by numerator. Upper number, numerator. Up, upper number is numerator, okay? Yes. So, while defining it, we can write, define it like this. The upper number or part, okay, of a fraction is called numerator okay so according to this suppose there is given a by b in example okay yes. in example suppose there is given yeah, yeah. a by b yes okay so there a is what a is the numerator of course it's a numerator yeah numerator yes. because this is given uh, on the upper part of the fraction, fraction okay yes. in the same way suppose there is given 3 by okay 2 okay yes in this condition what 3 becomes the numerator okay yeah got it sir okay so of course uh, my dear students we are here in a program very short program that you know already our Naval police school has launched the radio online program which is uh, sponsored by radio uh, media partner radio Madhesh Masala and uh, Nepal Police School Jingariya Garuda and uh, today in our studio our respected Santosh sir is teaching of class 4 math so I hope you every students listen carefully and uh, focus in the study thank you please carry on Santosh okay now the second part is that means we left the lower part okay? yes sir, yes sir. so just with, uh, now we talk about lower part okay the lower part is known as uh, denominator okay okay sir. denominator okay this is the uh, lower part so we can uh, define it like this the lower part of a fraction is called denominator okay got it sir in the same way we can give some uh, example we can take some example from okay from the example of that fraction that we have i have given to you yes sir. okay here we have some example like this suppose a by b okay there in a by b a is numerator in the same way that there uh, we have we have taken that upper part but in the same year we should take the lower part as the denominator okay yes sir in the same way okay let's take other example suppose uh, the same example 3 by 2 there the upper part is numerator in the same way here the lower part is numerator denominator denominator sorry uh, okay denominator okay okay sir these two are the okay these two are the parts of a special parts of what uh, that means fractions, fractions. okay yes without 
combining these two parts, yes, sir. the fraction never form. Okay? Never form. Yeah, okay, got it, sir. Okay, and uh, of course, uh, uh, this uh, fraction chapter is uh, very, very important to the learners uh, and my, uh, our viewers and uh, our uh, students, uh, uh, they uh, will uh, got 100% uh, uh, good uh, guideline from our Santosh Kumar Thakur sir. Uh, sir, uh, please. Uh, then after, we have uh, terms. Yes, okay. Terms uh, and condition. Yeah. No, 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 terms. Okay, yes. Okay, this is uh, related to friction. Yes. This sir. is a topic or a point that relates uh, a, uh, to with our friction chapter. Yes. Sir. Okay. Mm -hmm. Especially, okay, we write, okay, three by four, okay. Yes. Uh, sometimes one by two. Yes, okay. Sir. Half, half of uh, three. It means what? Three by. Okay, half of three means one by two of, sorry, one by two of three, okay? Okay. Sir. It means three by two. Yes. Usually we write it okay. like this, three by two. Half of three means three by two like this. So these are the terms, okay? Yes, sir. That we use to write a fraction, okay? Or what we write to use fraction? That things is known as, that terms, that condition is known by terms. Yes. Okay, especially yes. Yes, we can write the numerator or sorry and denominator are terms of a fraction okay yes the number that we use to form a fraction yes. that numbers are especially known as especially known as a Terms, okay. Yes, sir. In the same way, we have types of fraction. Then uh, after this, uh, we should enter in the type of fraction. Yes. We are, uh, as we know, there are different types of fractions. Okay. Especially today, we learn some of them. That is types of fraction. Okay. Yes. Sir. In the first, we will talk about like fraction. Like fraction. Like fraction. Yes. Like fraction. Okay. Yes. Uh, like. Yeah. Yes. Sir. That means you want. Yeah. Okay. Especially. Yeah. Here. Like means the same, okay? Yes. In this condition, we will define the fraction like this. The fraction, okay, having same denominator, okay, is the, uh, sorry, two or more okay sorry yeah. two or more than two fractions having same denominators are known as are known as like fraction okay yeah got it sir let's take some example for this suppose we have okay four by five okay Yes, sir. Suppose 2 by 5, okay? Yes. Sir. Suppose 3 by 5, okay? Mm -hmm. Here, we can see all the fractions have the same denominators, okay? Yes. Sir. What are they? 5, five, five, five. five. One, uh, The first fraction is 4 by 5, having 5 denominators. Yes. The second uh, fractions have 2, uh, sorry, 2 by 5, that is 5 denominators. Yes. In sir. the same way, the third one has also uh, 3 by 5, that means Five denominators. Yes. Okay. Yes. These all have the same denominators. Yes. Okay. That's why this friction, these frictions are known by like friction. Like friction. Okay. Yeah. Okay. To so be a like friction, it is required to have the same base. Uh, sorry, same base. That means same denominators. Yes. Okay. Okay, sir. Then after we have unlike friction. The next one is the yeah. The next friction. one. On the next one is 
the online friction. Yes. Online friction is just opposite of like friction. Okay. Okay, sir. Just opposite, but don't think uh, about the denominator. Okay. Yes, sir. it's a, just a different. Then. Yeah, just different in denominator. Yes. But it is not required to have the same denominator. Yes. Okay. Okay, sir. So here, uh, two or more than more than two friction having different. Okay, denominator. Yes, sir. Okay, denominators are called unlike friction. Okay, yeah, for yeah. its examples, okay, we can uh, take some example for this. Okay, suppose. 4 by 5, okay? Yes. Sir. Uh, 2 by 3, okay? Yes. Sir. Then after uh, 5 by 2, yes, sir. okay? Mm -hmm. This, okay? In each of the given fractions, yes, okay? Their denominators are different, okay? Yes. In the first one, we have the example, we have the fraction that is 4 by 5. Yes. In the same way, in the second one is 2 by 3. Mm -hmm. The third one is 5 by 2, okay? In each of the uh, given fractions, their denominators are different to each other. Yes. Sir. Yes. Yes, of course. Got so, it, if their denominators are different to each other, then it becomes or it is known by unlike fractions. Unlike fractions. Fraction because their fraction, uh, their denominators are unlike. That unlike. means not same. Yes. Okay. Sir. Yeah, got it, sir. So, of course, uh, my dear students, uh, we are learning from the fraction classes uh, and uh, uh, in the related fraction our respected Santosh sir has teaching different types of techniques different types of method that uh, uh, you can uh, see in your screen if you are watching in the facebook if you don't watching in the facebook you can just listen your radio uh, from our radio mudesh masala and description for megahertz that program is brought to you by, brought to you by Nepal Police School. This program is running every Sunday to Friday as per the usual time that we have already shared to the masses to concern our students. Okay, so Santosh sir, please carry on. Okay, then after our third type okay, of fraction is proper fraction. Proper fraction, yes. 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 In this fraction, okay, in this friction, uh, there there is also two parts, numerator yes. and denominators. Okay. Yes. Or always a uh, formation of a friction. Okay, needs two number. That means numerator and denominators. Yes. Okay. Yes. But in this proper friction or in the type of frictions, we need also two type of two two numbers. Yes. We are numerators should be uh, smaller than the denominators. Okay. Yeah, Whatever okay. the denominators, yes, so that should be greater by the denominator. Yes, okay. okay In the same way, we can define it like this: the fraction, okay, yes, having a smaller, okay, numerator, yes, than its denominators. Okay. Yes. Is known as proper fraction. Yes, God is. Okay. Yes. For uh, example, we can let some uh, fractions. Okay. Yes. Which has the less uh, denominator than yeah, their denominators. Yes. Okay. Yes. For example, suppose four by five. Mm. Okay. Then some same way two by three. Okay. Uh, then after five by nine. Okay. Yes. We have three examples of proper fraction, and each in each fraction we can see here. The first one is four by five, where numerator is smaller than denominators. Yes. In the same way, the, in the second example, two by three. Yes. Okay. Where also two is smaller than three. That yes. means it's denominator. Yes. In the same way. Five. Uh, the third one is five by nine. Where 
5 is as denominator and it is smaller than by its denominator 9. 9. Okay? Yes, sir. So here, being these, one, these yes. facts, they are proper fraction. Fraction. Okay? Yeah, yeah. okay, got it, sir. Then after our fourth number, that means four type, yes. uh, is improper fraction. Improper fraction. Improper fraction. This is just opposite of proper fraction. Okay? Yes. Sir. Whatever you learn in proper fraction, it is just opposite of that one. Yes. Okay, in this uh, we can define this like this the fraction having uh, greater or bigger yes sir bigger numerator greater than its denominators okay yes sir Denominators is known as improper fraction. Okay? Yes, okay. Thanks. For this example, mm -hmm. we can let some example like this. Mm -hmm. Suppose just we can write, suppose 5 by 4. Yes, sir. Okay? Yes, sir. In the same way, 3 by 2. Yes, sir. Yes? Yes. In the same way, 9 by 5. Okay, yes, so yes. in each example, we can uh, uh, see here, look here, yeah. that uh, the first one example is 5 by 4, yes, sir. which has 5 is, uh, is given as numerator and 4 is given as denominator, where numerator 5 is bigger than the denominator 4, yes, in the same way, th the second one is 3 by 2, yes, where 3 is greater by the its denominator, sorry, denominator 2, in the same way, the third one is 9 by 5, where the denominator 9 is greater by or bigger by its denominator 5. Okay? Yeah, and being this sir. fact, these are improper fraction. Improper fraction? Yeah. Okay. Of course, uh, about the related uh, chapter, uh, our Santos is, Santos sir is running the class. And uh, my every uh, students, I, I hope uh, you will rearrange your memory for the fraction classes that uh, you better to use your uh, different types of uh, uh, link from the uh, source of uh, YouTube and the uh, manual study uh, after the related type of uh, uh, good focus you will uh, learn much more thing about the fractions so please Sandhusar carry on after this yes uh, for two days for two days uh, we just come at the end of the classes of class 4. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. After this, we will learn uh, the type of friction in our next class. Yes, sir. Okay. For today, uh, this is the time for the homeworks. Okay, sir. Okay. Nice, nice sir. That's nice. Uh, today, in our class, we learn fraction. In fraction, we discuss on different topics. Yes, sir. That is numerator. The second one is denominator. The third one is uh, terms. The fourth one is like term, sorry, like fraction. Fourth one is unlike fraction. Okay, fifth one is proper friction and the last one is improper friction okay these topics that we learn today okay and then after our homework is like this your homework is define the following terms uh, the first one define the following In A, uh, we have, you have to write the definition of terms, 
Okay? Yes, sir. In B, uh, you have to write the definition of unlike fraction, unlike fraction, and the C third one is a uh, denominator. Okay? Yes, sir. And uh, the second question is like this. Uh, separate the separate the like and unlike fraction from the given. Okay? Yes. Here the given fractions are like this four by three. Okay? Yes. Sir. Nine by five. Uh, 2 by 3, yes, sir. 6 by 4, or 6 by 5, yes, sir. sorry, 6 by 5, then after uh, 5 by 2, then after 1 by 3, this much. These are your homeworks. And I hope you will uh, do it and you will, your solution, you will send. Yeah. Okay, uh, thank you, uh, Santosh Kumar uh, Thakur sir, uh, uh, here in uh, Radio Mandesh Masala. Of course, uh, it's a time to a uh, very short commercial break. And uh, before we are going to break, I would like to tell you one more thing, my dear students. This is the class for every viewers, every listeners, we can learn much more thing, much more education related to the subjects. Nepal Police School has published the related types of timing schedule to your concern, messenger related place. So everyone, I hope the schedule you have to follow. If you are logged into the Facebook, you can look at the video in the live screen also. If you don't have internet facility at your home, then you can listen the Radio Modest Masala FM 106.4 MHz. It is in Garuda. And the media partner Radio Modest Masala 106.4 MHz give us a great opportunity to share the knowledge about the related concern subject matter our nepal police school has decided major subject hell sorry major subject english math science from class 2 to 5 every sunday to friday and uh, it's a time to break now so i would like to return back one more and uh, i would like to tell you one more thing before short breaks you need to manage your course of content about the related class 5 so thank you see you again thank you radio mandes masla 106.4 megahertz mein ab samay hai vyaparik vishram ke तब तक अपने भी हाथ साबुन पानी से मल मल के धो के आओ कोरोना वायरस से अपने भी बचू आ दूसरों के बचाओ सूचना 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 कोरोना वायरस संक्रमण संबंधी अत्यंत जरूरी सूचना हाल विश्व भर फैल रहा कोरोना वायरस से नेपाल उच्च जोखिम में रहा विश्व स्वास्थ्य संगठन के प्रतिवेदन अनुसार कोरोना वायरस से हो रहा आ हो सके वाला संभावित जोखिम से बचेला कोनो किस्म के सभा जुलूस मेला आदि न करे न करावे के लिए अनुरोध कर जाय है कोरोना वायरस से बचे वाला उपाय भीड़ से बचू चले के समय मास्क के प्रयोग करू साबुन पानी से नियमित हाथ धो कम पाकल मांस मछली न खाओ दही दूध घी पनीर आदि के सेवन करू सरल खाए वाला चीज न खाओ खाए वाला चीज के निमन से धो के आ अच्छा से पका के मात्र खाओ एक आपस में अभिवादन कैला पर नमस्ते करू हाथ न मिलाओ एक आपस में शारीरिक दूरी कायम रखू खोखला पर या छीक अला पर आगाड़ी के 
व्यक्ति के विपरीत दिशा में अपन मुख छोपू रोग संक्रमण लागल संख्या लगला में स्वास्थ्य तथा रोग नियंत्रण कार्यालय के कॉल सेंटर नंबर तेरह उनचालीस में जानकारी दी तथा चिकित्सक संगे संपर्क करो दैनिक रूप में पानी गर्म क के मात्र प्रयोग करो ब्रॉडकास्टिंग एसोसिएशन ऑफ नेपाल आ रेडियो मधेश मसला गौड़ा द्वारा जनहित में जारी संदेश रेडियो मधेश मसला वन हंड्रेड सिक्स पॉइंट वेलकम बैक आफ्टर शॉर्ट कमर्शियल ब्रेक हेयर इन रेडियो मदेश मसाला हंड्रेड सिक्स पॉइंट फोर मेगा हर्स वी आर रनिंग द प्रोग्राम रेडियो एजुकेशनल ऑनलाइन प्रोग्राम 2077 थाउजेंड सेवेंटी सेवेन विच इज ब्रॉड टू यू बाई नेपाल पुलिस स्कूल एंड अफकोर्स वी आर कंटिन्ू फॉर द स्टडी एंड नाउ इट्स अ सेकेंड आफ्टर द ब्रेक वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट क्लास फाइव रिलेटेड सब्जेक्ट मैटर सो संतोष कुमार सर I would like to uh, request you or uh, please uh, uh, carry on the walk. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Okay. After class four, just now we enter in class five. Yes, sir. Or in class five uh, today, uh, we will discuss on the topic or on the chapter. Yeah. Algebra. Yes, sir. This is also not a first chapter. Yes. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, thanks for the confirmation, sir. Because I think. Uh, Uh, it's okay. our first class, so that's because yeah. I think uh, you will start the first chapter. That's because I'm asking you, okay? Yeah, so we are in math. There are different parts, and uh, we should mm, ask the answer questions from different sectors. Yes. That's why it is not possible to teach only one. That means from first to uh, last. Okay. okay. We should select the topics, and then after we need to teach <laughs> uh, yeah, them. Okay. 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 Uh, thanks for the clear of my vision. Okay. Uh, then after yes. here. Uh, in algebra, yes, sir. Today, uh, just first upon we need to know about algebra. Okay. Yes, sir. So, I think you have listened about uh, the two terms. That yes. is, constant and variables. Okay. Yes. Sometimes just we think what is what are they? Constant and variables. Okay. Yes. yes. So. In the short or in the simple form, we can say that these are algebra. Okay, these are algebra. Yes. yes. Okay. We here yeah. we can write like this. Uh, it is a branch of mathematics. Okay. Yes, sir. Which deals. With constant and variables. Okay. Yes. Here, while defining algebra, we have the main two points. Okay, they are constant and variables. Okay. Yes. It has the main two points here: constant and variables. Okay. Yeah. Before understanding these constant and variables, it is not possible to get inside the chapter, okay? Yes. Because these two points are the main points of algebra, okay? Yes. So here, while uh, to know about algebra, first uh, I need to define it, yes. okay? Yes. Sir. So here, constant, okay? Yes. Constant, okay? What do you mean by constant? Okay, first of all, so here we can write like this. The things, okay. The things, yes, sir. Objects, okay. Yes. Or letters, or letters, yes, sir. Having fixed not chains, values. Value, okay. Yes. Sir. Is uh, of things, object, letters is known as 
constant yeah constant yes the things object later okay. have been fixed not since uh, value okay. is yeah. constant right sir okay okay are known are known as constant constant okay yes please carry on sir here what are such things okay yes. that have the same values okay we should uh, uh, take some example for uh, to clearance this okay let's take example okay in example yes sir let's take okay a yes okay that letter yes. or that object that things would be a yeah maybe okay okay sir where uh let's take a represent where a represents represent yes the natural number less than 2 okay yeah okay got it sir yes in number system we have learned this already in uh, that means uh natural number is always started from one and goes so on yes so here this example uh, denoted us that yes. natural number which is less than two so there is only one number that is less than two that is one okay yes, yes okay. so here the value of a is what a only one a, a yes the value of one is that means this one represents only one number that is one that is one yeah because one is only smaller than less than two yes okay yes. that's why we can write a is equal to one where yes. it shows the value of a is what one okay in the yes. same way somewhere you can find like this x is equal to two yes sir. okay yes sir there what the value of x is what two, two. this is also only that yes. means only two okay yes. Yes, no sir. more yes. than two or less than two okay yes sir it is fixed okay that's why this is constant letter yes. okay yes in the same way okay if we talk about variables yes, okay sir. variable is just opposite thing of constant it's opposite yeah it's opposite just opposite okay yes sir okay so variable variable yeah, yeah. okay yes so here the things objects yes sir or letters okay yes sir having different yes sir the things object letters having different different or can be changed yes yes okay different or can be changed the things objects letters having say a different or can be changed value yes sir okay yes sir. are known as variable variable okay yes sir got it sir for its example we can uh, let same or uh, examples like this here example yes sir let's other letter okay suppose okay we have many more letter from a to z yes. we can suppose any one letter from them okay suppose let's take yes sir. okay uh, here suppose uh, i suppose z okay z yes. represents the okay yes, natural sir. number natural numbers between one and five five okay okay sir. so as we know okay yes sir uh the natural number is started from one yes, okay sir. and going so on yes sir and we have here okay yes sir. in the example there is given what the there is given the numbers between one and five okay yes, yes, it sir. means 
How many numbers are there from 1 to 5? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. How many numbers? There are altogether 5, five numbers. numbers yes. Okay? Yes. But we should take such numbers between 1 and 5. Okay? And then num the numbers are, okay, 2, 3, and 4. Okay? Yes. Yes. Because they are between 1, one to two, 5. five. Okay? Yes. Yes. So here, we should write Z is equal to what? 1, one. sorry, sorry, 2, uh, two, two three, 4. 3, four. 4. Yes. It means what? Z represents 2. Yes. Okay. In the same way Z represents 3. Okay. In the same way Z represents 4. Okay. It means what? Z has how many values? 3, three values. Three values okay. okay. Yes. 2, 3 and 4. Okay. Yes. yes. It may be ch it may change its values time to time. Okay. Yes. If we write Z equal to 2 that is not wrong. If we write z equal to 3, that is also not wrong. If we z equal, write z equal to 4, that is also not wrong. Okay? Yes. It means yes. what? Z can change its values time to time, which is not related to constant. Okay? That means what? This yes. is, it has many more values or being many more values, z represents variable. variable. Okay? Yes, sir. Got it, sir. Somewhere uh, in the, uh, what, uh, equation terms, Yes. You can see J x equal to suppose okay zero okay uh, yes. two okay four like this. In this condition also J x here x is representing the Value. values so as variables. Okay. Yes. Okay. Somewhere, but sometimes the number that comes in counting. Okay. Suppose the number of Junes of Nepal. Yes. Okay. Yes. As we know all that, there are only 14 Junes in Nepal, okay? Yeah. In yeah. in this condition, what? We can count it or the answer of Junes is only 14, okay? Yeah. It is countable or it can be counted at one time, okay? That means 14, 14 okay? No yeah. one, two, three, like this, okay? Yeah. It is only one that is 14, 14 okay? Yeah. Yeah. So that what? It comes under constant or variable, that comes under constant, constant. because yeah. Yeah. Nepal has 14 Junes, okay? Yes. If, if yes, the question comes under like this, yeah. okay? Yes. Name of Junes, okay? Yeah. Then it becomes what? Variable. Variables. Because yeah. there are 14 names. You have to write 14 names, okay? Not just like Not 14. Only one name. Yeah. yeah you have to write 14 names. That's why it comes under variable, variable. sound or variable letters, okay? Yes, sir. Okay, got it, sir. After this, we have... Um, other topic okay sir please carry on that is term terms term okay so about the related class of fraction that is very very important uh, terms right sir the yeah. terms is very important yeah. you know about the fraction variable and constant it's very important okay, okay yeah here yes terms yeah okay we can uh, we use uh, sometimes suppose we use two okay yes sir while using algebra or learning algebra sometimes we use two sometimes use x yes. okay yes. sometimes use a b okay sometimes we use a two x sometimes x square like this many more things that mm, we use to write or to uh, use to solve the problems inside algebra yes. okay if we use these letters single okay these are the single letters yes okay yes these single letters are especially known by terms okay yes sometimes we also use x by y yes okay this is also a term okay in this condition we can define it like this okay yes the terms yes sir the terms is a number or variables a variable a term is a number or a variable Variable of product of co 
constant and variable in the same way or division or that means quotient okay yes of constant or variable well or both okay okay sir or both okay sir the terms okay the terms is a number yeah number represents constant values yes. okay number represents constant value generally we use uh, in the constant number we use 1 2 3 4 5 5 these are especially known by constant values constant yes. number yes. Okay, because one never change itself yes okay one is always one yes. two is always two okay yes. so that uh, as, as a place of constant we can also write number yes. okay yes. so Terms, the terms is a number. Okay, that means suppose two. Yes. Okay. Yes. A variable. That means suppose x. Okay, it is a variable. That means a product of constant and variable. Product of constant and variables. Yes. Sir. Okay. Yes. Yes. Sir. In the same way, or division. That means quotient. Okay. Yes. Of constant variable, of constant uh, variables. Okay. Or both. Okay. Both. And or is Count. known as. Okay. Yes. Sir. Known as term. Term. Okay. okay for the example of terms you we can use these are these are the examples okay, of okay these terms. are the example of terms okay 2 by y y by 2 okay yes sir or a b okay these all are the example of terms yes okay then after okay uh रेडियो मदेश मिसाल अंडिस्ट्रीशन फोर मेगा हज दोज लिस्नर्स हु आर इन द फेसबुक लाइव दे कैन इजली सीन द फोकस ऑफ द रिलेटेड सब्जेक्ट मैटर एंड दोज हु आर नॉट इन द ऑनलाइन दे विल लिसन द स्टेट इन रेडियो मदेश मसाला अंडिस्ट्रीशन फोर मेगा हज बिकॉज दिस प्रोग्राम इज ऑल्सो Uh, running through the FM stations that you can uh, listen uh, by radio Madhesh Mishra and his sister four megahertz. Okay, so Sandosh Thakur sir, uh, uh, please uh, uh, carry on your. Thank you. Okay, then after terms, we have also uh, the two types of terms yes, there. Yes. Yes. That means we can uh, let type of terms, types of terms. Okay. Yes, sir. Inside the types of terms, okay. Or before in, uh, uh, inside the types of terms, just let we talk about its coefficient, base, and index, okay. Yes. They are coefficient, coefficient. Okay, sorry, double F. Yeah. Okay. Coefficient, okay. Yes. Sir. Here for coefficient, we can define it like this: the numer numerical. Okay. Yes. Or numeral. Numerical. Or, or numeral. Okay. Yes. yes. Factor of term of a term is known as coefficient. Coefficient. Okay. Yes. Sir. Like that. Here. Yeah. Suppose we have. Example two x. Yes. Okay. Yes, sir. So in this two x, this is a term. Okay. Or in two x, there are two numbers. Okay. That is one and x. Okay. Yes. That means one is constant and another is variable. Variable. So numerical means or numeral means that is number. Okay. Yes. So that is two. Okay. Number means two. There is two, and between them there is the sign of multiplication. That's why they comes under. Uh, directed to x yes, okay, because yes. uh, uh, sign of multiplication is hidden yes. over there so that's why we write to x we can direct pronounce to yeah, x to x there is the hidden multiplication yeah, right there is hidden multiplication oh, okay, okay. okay for that here two is the coefficient of the term to x okay yes. because this two is the numerical num or, or the numerals yes okay yes. factor of the term okay yes. in the same way okay somewhere 
uh, we see like this x. Okay, yes. here. Yes. So he, on this condition, what? There is also a numerical factor or neural factor which is hidden. Okay. Yes. Uh, as we know that uh, we have suppose one into a. Okay. Yes. yes. Or suppose before this one into two. What will we write? We write two. Two only. Yes. Yes. Sir. Okay. We don't need to write this one because after uh, in the table of one after reading two one that uh, uh, one two za okay then means we, we we have only two okay yeah, yes. in the same way if we multiply one by any number okay yes any number the answer would be the same okay yes sir. okay like that what one is multiplied by a okay yes. the so the answer would be the same as the given number okay yes. so yes. We have the answer A in the same way on this condition. X is multiplied by suppose one. Okay, yes. we later have to suppose. Okay, so one is multiplied by what? X. Yes. Then we will get the answer X. Yes. Okay, because yeah, one is hidden. Yes, okay? one is hidden. Or also we have the uh, that facts. If one is multiplied by any number, the yes. answer would be the same as same. the number. Yes. Okay. Yes. 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 So here one is hidden. Okay. So one multiply. Yux, we can write like this. Oh. Okay, after this, what our answer would be? Yux. So the coefficient of this term is what? One. One. Okay, because one is hidden. Hidden. Yes. Got then after we have. Okay. Yes. Uh, base. Then after we will talk about base. Base. It's a uh, uh, another uh, next uh, another, types of another type uh, another uh, type of no, terms. No terms. Uh, uh, part of terms. It's a part of terms. Parts so, of yeah, terms. It's parts. Okay. Hmm. Okay, sir. Here we can write the parts of terms. Parts of terms. Parts of terms. Yes. Okay. Then after we have base. Okay. Coefficient. Then next coefficient. The base. Then base. Yes. Okay. Yes. In base we can write the literal factor or variable factor. Also yes. we can write. Yes. Variable factor. Factor of a term, okay, yes, is known as base. Base, okay. What are such base? Suppose we have the example two x. Yes. Okay. Let's take example two x. Okay. Yes. In these two x, okay, yes. as we know, this is a numerical factor. Yeah. Of okay. Yes, sir. Then after one is left, okay, and as we know that. From A to Z, these all numbers are comes under the variable okay. letters. Okay, and for the definition of base, as we know that it needs literal factor. Literal means letter, alphabetical. Then after variables. Okay, that means which is also alphabet. Okay, A B C D like this. So that is what only X. Okay. Yes. So this X is the base of the term two X. Okay, it's a base. Yeah. In the same way, we have other here, x. So in this condition, what one is coefficient? This means only one left. That is x, which is, is the base. base. One. Okay. Uh, yes, sir. Got it, sir. Then after the third part, okay. Yes. That is index. Index. Okay. Yes, sir. Index. In index, we can uh, uh, say like this or define like this to index. That is the power. Okay, power of variables. Variable is known as index. Index. Okay. Okay. Sir. For this, we can let some examples. Suppose I uh, I was given you some example in the terms two x square. Yes. Sir. Okay. Yes. Sir. In this condition, what this this is a variable. Okay. And on the head of variable there is given two, okay? Yes. So that the head number is called power, which is known as index. Okay, uh, this head number. Actually, uh, Santosh sir, uh, I'd like to uh, remain remember uh, remind you that you know yeah. uh, uh, actually uh, the scarcity of our time, we are going to uh, so close. Yeah. So because this uh, is the last topic. Uh, okay. So uh, please. Uh, uh, Give me the uh, give the assignment to the students, uh, to the learners, uh, as soon as possible. 
because uh, uh, our time is uh, running very fastly okay so uh, yeah yes uh, of course uh, uh, we can so so we yes, can sir. give a sort here yes sir. this is index okay yes, this sir. is base yes sir then this is coefficient, coefficient. Coefficient. Yes. Okay. Yes. And at last, your homework is. Yes. Okay. In one number. Define the following. Where in a number, you have to write definition of constraint. Constraint. And like term, okay. Yes, then sir. after, in question number two, write the coefficient base and index of the following terms. The question is like this. Yax three x sorry three y c seven a x q. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thanks. Uh, uh, thank you, Sandu sir. Okay, my dear students. Of course, uh, we are going to uh, close this uh, short program because of the time consuming of our time uh, we hope uh, you will learn much more and expect for your good response it's time to go now so thanks for being with us uh, thanks to uh, mr santosh kumar thakur sir thank you sir being with us here in the radio madhesh misala and description 4 megahertz and uh, of course uh, thanks to my colleague sarje suraj for the technical support have a good day. Bye bye. Namaste. Namaste and bye bye. And uh, please uh, uh, stay safe because you know the uh, during this period we are uh, um, totally uh, under the trap of COVID-19. So I would like to request you all the students please stay safe at your home and uh, protect against through the viruses. Thank you. Thank you all. Have a good day. Bye bye. Radio Madhya Smasla Time Check. Din ke teen bajal hai. Jan jan ke man se.